Hey everyone, so I decided to start up my own Pokemon region based in Prehispanic Mexico. And of course, let's start up with the starters. I decided to base these starters in some animals the Aztec people worshipped. In today's episode, we are designing the fire starter, based on both an eagle and a red moco. You see, in the past, the Aztecs used to think the eagles represented the sun, and the Mayans thought the red moco represented the sunsets. So I decided to combine these two for this region's fire starter. I decided to start this line with a Pokemon who really wants to fly but can't, so I really wanted to capture that in the pose. Also, I wanted its personality to be quite like a little child, just wanting to draw attention from everybody. That's why I decided to give it bright and colors. I wanted to make a balance between the eagle and moco aspect, so I wanted the eagle part to stand a little bit more because of the Mexican flag that has an eagle eating a snake in it. And here it is, Maglu from Mako on Eagle, Antenna 2, which is how Aztecs refer to the god of the sun and also the sun itself. It's purifier for now, and its wings are not strong enough to fly, however, it tries flying by all means. It tries drawing attention from its trainer with its fire powers. Every shiny form in this line was designed with the Mako color palette over the Eagle one. For the middle form, I thought about adding some aspects from Los Voladores de Papantla or the Papantla Pole Flyers in English. They are a group of dancers that get in a pole and tie themselves with some sort of rope and start soaring the wind while doing tricks. So I decided that this Pokemon should do something like that. And here it is, Pleco from Tletl, the Nahuatl for fire, and Moko, still not a flying type. This Pokemon can't fly yet, but it uses its tail to attach to trees and it circles around it to train its wings. It often ends up burning the tree. The shiny again is designed to accentuate more the Moko aspect. For the final evolution, I decided to finally give it the ability to fly, so I wanted to capture how proud it is to finally be able to do it. I wanted to look graceful and majestic while flying. And here you go, Tona Coggle from Tona 2, Moko and Eagle. It loves flying around to show off its colors, which overlap the sun. However, they have issues hunting, you know, because they are pretty bright. And that's it, the fire starter for our new unnamed region based in pre-Hispanic Mexico. Yeah, this region is still unnamed, maybe when we get to the legendaries, we can come up with an actual name for the region. But yeah, let me know what you think about this one in the comments down below. 
also the illustrations are going to be posted in my instagram so follow me in there and check them out in the next episode we are going to be creating the water star so don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss it also leave a like if you enjoyed this video or learned something new see you all next sunday Thank you.